Welcome to Unit 2 of PRDV 301, Introduction to Paralegal Studies. Now that we've introduced you to the roles and practices of paralegals, it's time to start learning more about the law and legal systems. In this unit, you'll learn about legal systems specifically, the one in the United States. The U.S. legal system has three important characteristics, separation of powers, federalism, and a background in common law. Each branch has important powers, all its own. The branches also have the power to limit each other through a system of checks and balances. The U.S. government is further separated by levels in a system called federalism. States have powers distinct from those of the national or federal government, and each of the states has its own constitution and separation of powers. The United States and U.S. territories operate then, not just under one government, but under many which divide up the powers and responsibilities of government. The U.S. legal system also has important roots in the English system of common law. In common law systems, which include the United States, the United Kingdom, Canada, and Australia, law is developed not only by legislatures, but also by judges. Through legal decisions, the courts have developed a body of law that has just as much effect as statutes passed by legislatures. This unit will also go a bit beyond the American legal system. You'll be introduced to the civil law systems of much of Europe, Central, and South America, in which the law is set by extensive statutory codes. By the end of this unit, you'll have a good grounding in the systems of law in which paralegals and other professionals work, and you'll be ready to consider sources of law in the American system, as well as in the court system procedures. Good luck. <laughs>